A lot of people did what everyone has been advising and just stayed home today, but tomorrow's another story. You may be going to work for the first time this week. Before you leave the driveway, a few common sense tips worth repeating. Of course, you need to clear the windshield of ice and snow, but don't forget the front headlights. Not only do they help you see better, but they help other motorists see you as well. The same goes for the back of the car. But the most important thing you can do is to make sure you clear away the snow from your exhaust pipe, especially if your car's running. Carbon monoxide can build up inside your car and kill you if you're not careful. Also, if you're stopping somewhere, be conscious of parking near those snow banks with the car running for that very same reason. Good advice. Well, all roads in Ohio are open. The Level 3 snow advisories have been upgraded to Level 2 throughout much of our viewing area. Now, Sauda and Pike counties are at Level 1, which means roads are patchy in spots. Jackson County has lifted all snow warning levels. As News Channel 3's Christina Tyler explains, though the roads look good now, they may not be good for long. Ralph Kelly walked to work this morning. He didn't want to drive. He spent the day filling prescriptions for people stuck at home by snow. We'll rent a four-wheel four -wheel drive vehicle, call my son in, and uh, he'll, uh, he'll go make the home deliveries for the people that uh, would be needing medications. Most main roads are clear in southern Ohio, but many rural areas haven't seen a snow plow or a salt truck in a while. Those rural roads are icy and hazardous, but in Portsmouth, the streets are clear, and people are getting out with little trouble. I live in town now, and when we lived with my parents, it was, you know, a mile and a half down some back road, and there was no chance of getting out until the sun let us out. So now, even, even though there's still plenty of snow on the ground, we can get out and, you know, come get a movie. Many people in southern Ohio say they're digging out from the blizzard so soon because this time they were prepared. Yeah, I think we had enough warning and people got out and got uh, their supplies in. Roads are not passable and some of the highways, they're, you know, passable but they're not completely cleared. Most calls coming into local police dispatchers are about road conditions, not emergency calls. People have indeed prepared themselves. We've had uh, less activity through the sheriff's office and through our 911 communication center than what we would have had in normal uh, conditions. The sun and salt have had a chance to melt the snow on Route 52, but when the sun goes down and the temperature drops, police fear even the good, clear roads will become icy and dangerous. Christina Tyler, WSAZ News Channel 3, Scioto County, Ohio. And dispatchers urge people...